Kariba. Kariba Dam, and this is the stranglehold that modern man has got on the wild Zambezi River in Africa. The Pick's magic carpet today is a carpet of water, the world's widest man-made lake, still flooding brushland and forest, as vast, tamed hydroelectric power is built up for the exciting purpose of transforming this wild, wild land, Rhodesia, and all the riches that are waiting to be fished up. Forget for a moment any controversy there is about southern Rhodesia and see it as what it's becoming, an exciting holiday land where patrol boats watch over the game reserves and where you can see the shape of our earliest yesterdays within calculated distance of the great new driving force that has come about. Buffalo on the brink of the most audacious electricity project that civilized man could devise. Here were unrestricted the deer and the antelope play. From the Kariba turbines, you turn to zebras in their natural habitat. This is a country just starting to move so fast that they've had to build special exhibition villages, like this one at Livingston, near the Victoria Falls, so that ancient crafts in danger of dying out can be preserved. These tribesmen live now on the tourist trade, in villages some of which were only built when the Kariba Dam flooded 2,000 square miles of their jungle. That stockade's a reminder of slave raid days. But they're getting rare, the native villages, where you'll see huntsmen with sheepskin bellows forging their buffalo spears. Kariba tribesmen built their huts on stilts for the sake of coolness and so that they have a day shelter underneath. The granaries got to be rat-proof. He's the man who makes the jungle drums, chipping them out of solid logs. But that's a craft that will never be lost, because the drum is something that the Africans have given to the whole grateful world. The drums and the most ancient modern rhythm of the dance. make their masks and costumes with sisal grass and fibers. They glean their colors from the local stones and vegetation. And there's many a Western art expert staggered by their craft. What Western circus would refuse the services of such an acrobat? This is the circumcision ritual, the dance that young men do as their adolescence hovers on the brink of manhood. It's much the same in our jazz clubs here in the Western world, though perhaps the Rhodesian hairstyles are more restrained. Remember the concrete of Kariba and try to equate that power with nature in the raw, as so effortlessly you see it at the Wanky National Park, perhaps the most rewarding of all Africa's game reserves. Now, what are they? News or bison? It's a herd of game that, for their own sake, the wardens have decided to head off into more promising territory. How did those animals survive before man came along to look after them? Now, what is it that's grey, weighs a ton, and remembers everything you tell it? An elephant. Tell them there's a good refreshing drink to be had this scorching day if they'll only press on to the car park where, conveniently, they'll find a man-made waterhole. There's a baby in that bunch. Just see if you can spot it keeping out of father's footsteps. But what else can we find here, out in this easy-reach bush? Well, well, I do believe we've found a lion, and not just a solitary one, a whole pride of them. Quiet a moment. 
These lions must have made a recent kill. Without ever leaving our motor road, here we are face to face with the untamed monarch of the animal world. The big cat padding her proud path just a shrub away from us. Our cameraman, Stan Guzzi, who was filming the Dagenham Girl Pipers Band a few days back, is here today shooting a spectacle of a very different kind. Don't let those camera-conscious elephants hog the screen, or nobody will believe the African elephant's in danger of dying out. Let's see some of the other creatures who share the waterhole with them. Because there's nothing like thirst for conquering the natural shyness of jungle animals. Water's a rare commodity in the African heat, and you'll even find those lofty creatures, the giraffes, unbending a bit for a drink. Why, it's a free-for-all. This is the drinking place where all shapes and sizes of creatures forget their differences and mix. Remember again Kariba and the new ultra-modern electric power that has come to this land. You recognize power here when you see it. What's going to happen in this rich country when untamed power is brought under control? Kariba. This isn't a mere meeting between new and old. This is the encounter between an unbelievable tomorrow and the whole panorama of yesterdays, which you can see today.